In this video, we're going to be raiding this new weapon, the Noxia Stinger. But without further ado, let's get straight on to this video. So this weapon is a melee weapon, and this weapon is actually way more overpowered if you actually know how to use it. Because a lot of people think the Reaper Scythe is better since it says 68 here, but it actually isn't. And you just gotta know how to use this weapon, right? So, we're gonna be testing this on Buffalo Course, and how you are going to use this weapon. Since the tick damage is one of the biggest parts in this so what you're going to do is hold down throw it then you're going to start attacking and just look how fast it is but now let's use the reaper's scythe and it just doesn't go as fast since it's only doing around 80 damage but then this one is doing tick damage plus 75 damage so it is doing a lot more damage when you actually put the tick damage to it but this will change depending on your levels since my light melee is higher than a heavy melee so this is especially really good if you're killing bosses like let me show you with the slime boss look how fast it's going because of the tick damage and the more you hit it the more tick damage it does as well what is another thing to actually learn because it is very helpful when you understand this weapon but yeah before we go on if this weapon is actually worth to actually buy or grind i've got some new merch link in the description so is this weapon actually worth grinding since you need two twos and Eight of the scales plus all the other resources and it is like I think it's like a hundred mil or something like if you were to go ahead and buy it in published islands so is this weapon worth it well yes but no it is worth it if you know how to use it but if you're just going to just be in desert island and grind yeah hundred percent it's worth it since you don't really have to buy anything but if you're gonna buy it I wouldn't wait for it to go down then it will start going back up again so buy it when it's at its lowest peak i would say 50 million if this weapon did not have its tick damage it would probably be one of the not as good weapons but yeah, if this video was helpful and you're looking towards making a shop here is 10 tips to start earning billions in roblox islands and now goodbye youtube